The list of family businesses folding up after the first or second generation is increasing. This is attributed to failure to plan for succession, which is embedded in poor corporate governance in these companies. 50% of the people over the age of 60 who control an organization or control a substantially large business or even an SME have sometimes not thought of succession planning. Um, 50% of the businesses uh, generally do not think of succession planning till it is quite late. Failure to plan for continuity not only hurts the company, but also those in the value chain, including investors and financials. Therefore, a planning early and involving external people may be key to survival. Yeah, the governance that we like to see is about structures of managing and overseeing the business. Um, and also the composition of the board of directors. Yeah, so ideally a business would already have at least one independent director. You know, somebody on the board of directors who's not a shareholder or a shareholder representative um, and in a non-executive capacity so that they're not actually running the business as well, right? They'll come to the board meetings and they'll read the papers and engage in that way but they're not every day employed by the business. While these principles work, it takes foresight and an overruling of the emotional attachment to a business to make them work. Joanne Salmon, NTV Business.